All right, so we have two performers wearing the Perception Neuron 2.0 version 32. And the question we got was, how do you get two suits to be virtually in the similar orientation to as where the actors are physically? So this is a quick tutorial on how to run a shoot when you're dealing with multiple Perception Neuron suits. So here they are standing on their secondary marks. And if we look at the data, you'll see that virtually they're in close orientation. So I'm gonna walk you through the process on how to do this now. First, Lindsay, go ahead and stand at zero. And Alan, if you'll go to the mark that's behind Lindsay. So right now I've asked Lindsay to stand on what is virtually zero, zero axis. And that's the center of the red X in the software. So what I'm gonna do is in the Axis Neuron software, I'm gonna perform a calibration on both characters by clicking the Calibrate button. I'm gonna uncheck Steady Pose since they're already suited up. And when I hit Next, you're in A Pose. And T Pose. And S Pose. Excellent, go ahead and relax for one second. So after calibration, you'll see that both characters are stacked at zero. That's not what we want. So what I'm gonna do is ask Lindsay, go ahead and go to your mark. And during this process, your talent has to take very deliberate steps and not shuffle or drag their feet. And so Alan, go to zero. Now, in the software, I'm going to zero out just Alan by coming down here, clicking Alan. Alan, give me a T pose. I'm sorry, an A pose, my bad. Have him hold an A pose. And when I hit the Z on just his character, he's moved to virtual center. Now, Alan, go ahead and take deliberate steps to your next mark. And at this point, they're lined up physically in close proximity to their virtual avatars. And now, we are ready to record a take. So give me a T-pose. You're gonna hit record, name it, whatever you'd like, and then hit OK, and execute your scene. So, uh, go ahead and move around each other and Okay, give me two poses. Okay, and cut. <laughs> 